right. So where do I make this liquid button hover effect inside our Elementor page? And for this we need an button widget. And here you can see I have already created a container. So inside that let's insert this. And first of all I want to change this text. And also make some basic styling with that. So make the background color to fully transparent and also give some border. Make it to solid one pixel and give its color to fully white. Okay. And here you can see this border radius. We don't need that. So make it to fully zero. Also make some changes on the typography. And lastly, also add some padding. And after that, finally, to add this hover effect, we need to add a class with that. Make it to liquid dash button. And then here we also need to add some custom CSS with that. And if you don't know, this custom CSS option is only available in Elementor Pro. So if you don't have Elementor Pro, you can quickly get this from my link on the description. Let's just paste this code. And then we also need to add some additional JavaScript code. So here let's search for the HTML widget and drag this under here. Also paste another portion of code. Okay. So here you don't need to worry about any of this code snippet. I'll give all the code snippet to my website and also give that code snippet link to my video description. So from here you just need to copy and paste that code. Okay. Now if we update this and see it on our preview. We can see that beautiful hover effect that's really awesome so now here for these buttons custom css if we look at here here we can see a link so if we just copy that url and paste it to here okay we can see this long image which basically contains all the frame for our animation so if you look carefully you can see this portion of the image is our first frame this one is the second one the third fourth and so on so when you hover over on this image you can actually see these frames one after another and that will create this incredible animation okay so if we go back again to here here at the top of our this code we can also see an option text hover color so from here if we make it to red okay now for our this hover state we can see that red color on here so if you also want to add a different color for that initial state, you can also set that from here. Perfect. Okay, but here now I want to undo all of these colors. Now here, this button is only working for a dark background. So here if we try to use this with a light background, so if we just duplicate this and for this container, if I set its background color to white, Okay, now for this one, we can see our hover effect is not perfectly working. So to make it work, we need to do a couple more things. Let's go to this button settings and from its style, first of all, we need to make its color to a dark color so we can see that properly and also make this border color to fully black. And then we also need to make our this hover color to a bright color. So make it to white. And after that, here at the bottom of this custom CSS, we also need to paste this additional code. Let's update this. And now we can see it's also perfectly working for our this slide background. Cool. So that's how we can create this liquid button hover effect on your Elementor website. If you enjoyed this tutorial, then don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on my next video.